This is the Meerkat in from FreeOnlineTradingEducation.com and Grok Trade. I want to talk about a trade we had in the Grok Star Room this morning on this last day of summer. That was on FCX. We'd been trading. It was a falling wedge here. Then we started to do a high base, but then it ended up being a symmetrical triangle. And here we are sitting here on what we call a bull pennant. That's a version of a bull flag. If you want to know more about that, just go to our site, freeonlinetradeeducation.com, right here to chart school. And we're going to look here at the chart patterns, and we want to look at bull flag. And a bull flag is a specific pattern where it runs up and it's coming down in, the, in a parallel line. But what this one happens to be, this is a bull pennant in that it is in a symmetrical triangle at the top. It isn't, it isn't coming back in a parallel channel, but it's in a symmetrical triangle like that. That would be a bull pennant. So let's take a look here again at the FCX trade, and it's doing that. So I'm going to set a trade right up here and let the market come to me. Let's see what happened here next. And boom, there it goes. And I'm in at $10.05. I'm long on FCX. Got to set a stop down here. Uh, just below this 200 pre moving average. That's what that big red line is there. And we're going to put it right below here. And let's uh, see what happens after that. Boom, boom. Oh, look at that. Nicely done, huh? So I'm going to pull my stop up here in the money now. And I'm going to put it here just below... Uh, this uh, 8 EMA. You see the 8 EMA running up here? It's pretty extended away. I'm going to put it right there. And what happened next? Bam! It, look at that. It dropped hard. That's over 1% drop. And then bam, it went down here and jumped off of this red dash line, which is the S1 pivot line. So uh, sure enough, I got stopped out at 10.18 for 1.2% on the first trade. So now it was setting up what's called a bull pullback. He came down to here to a line of support and it's starting to run up. You want to know more about the pullback trade, just again go to our site, freeonlinetradingeducation.com, and you go to chart patterns and you can go to bull pullback. And here it is running up. And then it pulls, in this case, it ran up and it pulled right back to that um, pivot line and started to roll back up. So again, if it continues to roll up, uh, we want to get long because the odds are in our favor. So here we are on FCX again. It's pulling back. I set a trade right up here. If it goes up that way, I want to get long. And what happened? Boom! There it goes. It touched it. But look at that. It hit it and then kind of yeah, didn't exceed. Um, the odds were in my favor right at that moment that it was going to continue up. But in this case, it's not. But then look, now it is. It just did another little mini bull pullback. But look at this. It's stuck here. It is stuck right here. It can't seem to break above this 1030 area, and why is that? Well, I want to talk about moving averages for a minute. It depends on your chart. This is a one-minute chart. For, for interday, it makes a big difference if I have the data turned on from pre-market, so it includes 200 points all the way back into pre-market, or if I don't. Now, this is my charts from the interactive brokers that I use and uh, it, it's here's this 200 pre moving average right at the ten dollar mark but I want you to look at freestockcharts.com which is another platform that I use this one does not include pre-market data and so look at that it, it's 200 pre moving average is sitting right there just underneath that 1030 area and look at it bam 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 it keeps hitting his head on it See, it, it, on the uh, IB chart, it just looks like it's in the middle of nowhere. But now we know why. It's resistance there. And so we just need to be patient that it kept hitting its head there. So it, I said, why is it stopped there? You don't know why. And, but now, which one should you watch? The answer is yes. Some people watch it with including pre-market data. Some watch it without. So you need to watch both. And uh, boom, there we go. We now finally broke out above that 200 pre moving average on the free stock chart side. And let's let it move it on up here. Let's, let's keep our keep moving our stop up here. And now it's stalling here at this S1 pivot line. This is the S2 pivot line. That's S1. And we move up. We're now high basing right at it. Look at that. Look at that. Okay, take your time. Take your time. Boom, there we go. We popped up above it. And I'm going to bring my stop up just underneath just underneath that pivot line and now the 20 moving average is right there that's where my stop is and drifting down bam stop down right there got me out ten dollars and thirty four cents for one percent on the second trade in 26 minutes these are interesting trades we had one that was a breakout pattern and one that was a pullback pattern uh, as one that people asked in my last video and these are two different ones 
if these are some strange terms to you and you'd like to learn more, you can get it, education from us. First step is free. Just go to our site, freeonlinetradingeducation.com, and right down below here is you can start your education. Right here, get six trading videos that I do. It's uh, uh, the 101 course. It is the basics of what trading is. And then if you want to move on from there, you can go into our uh, structured educational path. And you just, again, go to grocktrade.com. This is where our education is. That's a, the 101 course we talked about. Then the next step would be the 201 course, which is also online. But this is more how to trade than what trading is. So again, video-based, and you can read all the information about it right there. And then the third step would be to do mentoring, trading mentoring. That's where you hook up uh, with a trader, and we would be your tra your mentors for life. And here's more information about that. So one, two, three steps. In fact, we have a, a mentoring course coming up in Las Vegas. You can do them either online or live in Vegas, and uh, your choice. Mark the Meerkat. Just remember Mark Douglas's uh, Trading Truths number five. I have a plan to appropriately take my profits as the market gives them to me. Trade well.